So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to set up the goals, so KPI goals. Now based on what we set, we're going to find it here on the list. So KPI name, the one we're looking for is called Test KPI for Caesar Webinar. Now over here is where you would set your goals for your employees. Up here is where you would set the thresholds. So anything, and according to these thresholds, for your accessories, if 50 or less were sold, they're in the red. Now between 50 and 80, they're almost up to goal, but their goal will be over 80. Now you could set the goal up down here. Okay, so let me find my guy here. All right, this guy here, Bruce Wayne. Now I'm going to set his goal for 100 accessories sold this month. Now I want to select another, uh, now if I want to change the threshold I simply click here and decide what is acceptable to be considered red, yellow, and green. So I can change it to 60, so that means unless he sells 60, it's going to appear red with his name during the KPI indicators. So over here you would set the goals for this month. Now once you have that set up, we go over to commission rules and here's where you can set up commissions for your KPIs as well. Now if you were shown how to use the commission rule manager on wireless standard, it's very similar to this, it's just in a different location. So we'll go over to create profile profile name. Okay. And we're going to select it by employee and click OK. Now we have down here test commissions for Caesar webinar. We'll go over to the right and we'll create a rule. Now this will be a rule name. And then we decide what the rule is based on. Whether it's the goal of the KPI or the KPI value. Select goal, select the rule, sorry. So because we set the KPI goal, now we're going to find the KPI rule. And the KPI rule we're looking for is test KPI for Caesar webinar. Now we go to payout method. Now whether it's flat amount, percentage of the profit, revenue, monthly recurring charges, or if it's a bonus. So we'll do flat amount. And the payout for the KPI. Uh, now over here from 0% to whatever a percentage of their KPI met, they will receive a certain amount. So let's say they just made 80% of their goal. Then they'll be able to get a payout of like 10 bucks. And then click OK. Oh, sorry. Little tires. Oh my God. Pardon me. Uh, 
sorry. Uh, you set them up by tiers also. I, I forgot to show you that. Okay. So if they say they just made 10%, okay, they'll get a payout of like a dollar. Uh, sorry, one dollar. And then you add it. Okay. Now anything from 10 or greater, so if they make 10 to 20%, then they'll get two dollars on the commission. And now anything over, so if they get a hundred percent, they'll make three dollars. Okay. And that's the way you would set up the commission for the employees on a KPI. Now we go over here to rule assignment. Now assignment level. And choose employee. And commissions profile. We use Caesar test. So now that you created the commission profile, you select the employee that you wanna uh, that you wanna apply it to and then click on assign and now this guy has the commissions that I set up now commissions audit that's where you get to uh, check your commissions unfortunately I don't think I have any on my system I might Okay, so yeah, commissions audit, what I did is basically I updated all my commissions, make sure everything is uh, good, and I'm going to click on commission reports, employee commission summary, or location summary, or details. Now over here, based on the commissions I set up in the KPI, it will appear here. Unfortunately, I have a, I have a training database that I, it's not really, I haven't rang up sales or done commissions on this. This is why it's appearing blank. Okay. 